Hey guys, uh, as Grimzag is busy at the moment, uh, he let me use his workshop. So I'm going to show you how to make some awesome clown orc heads using well, using a bit of green stuff. It makes it more interesting on the battlefield. Uh, today we're going to be making some clocks. Are you ready? Great. Okay, you're going to need a few things before you start. First up, you're going to need some green stuff. You got some green stuff? Brilliant. Okay, next up, you're going to need some modeling knives. Got some modeling knives? Great. Okay, and then you're going to need a head to turn into a clock. Mm, so, pick, a, pick an orc. Okay, maybe put a bit more thought into it. Sure, okay, that's great. Okay, next up, you're going to need a smooth surface to work on, so I went with a small plate. Yep, should stop stuff sticking to it. I'll regret those words probably a bit later. Okay, next you're going to need some water, for if you have dry hands like Honker, then it stops the green stuff sticking to your fingers. Okay, then you're going to need your green stuff. Okay, once you've got your green stuff, just all you want to do is get a modelling knife and cut off the tiniest little slither off the top of the green stuff. And then once you've done that, you'll have the regretting words of trying to peel it off the plate because it just sticks to it anyway. All you need to do is mix it together really well. Get some water in your fingers if it's you know, sticking to your fingers, but make sure it's perfectly green. No random lumps of blue or yellow in there. You want to break off a small piece of green stuff of the lump you've generated, and mold it into basically a cone shape like that and then jam it onto the orc's head you probably have to do this a few times because um, I ended up having to do it several just to get the right size and try and make it a little bit bigger but not too big uh, and then just basically shape it onto the head to make it look like a, like a weird little blob hat. You take your head next and your modelling knife and cut round the base of the hat, sort of closest to the orc's head. Make a thin line that goes all the way around. Uh, if the knife gets stuck in the green stuff, just make sure you wet it every now and then just to stop it sticking. So you want to cut all the way around and then Try and force the two heart the two sort of the indent together to make it a solid line. Finally, you want to break off three tiny balls of green stuff, uh, and the first one you want to. You want to roll it into a perfect little ball and stick it on the very tip of the hat as a little bauble. And once you've done that and it stays there, take the second one and you cut it in half. It should all be equal size and then roll the two halves into their own little balls as well. And you want to stick those down the front of the hat. You can put them slightly off centre, whatever you like, but one above the other on the front of the hat. And then the last one, you want to stick uh, as a nose, 
on the orc's face. Now, it will probably need to be cut down as well, probably about the same size as the two that were on the front, but you know, trim off a bit of that and stick it on the nose of the orc. And there you have it. You have one clock head. You'll be out there entertaining and terrifying all of the locals. So, enjoy.